Forecast Center, meteorologist Brian Nisnatsky. All right, we have a light wind out of the north, and again, that continues to bring in some colder air. Say goodbye to almost the summertime heat that we had a couple days ago with the 60 degree temperatures, but now it's starting to feel a little bit more like winter out there. Again, temperatures this morning hovering around 20 degrees in most locations because we have the clear skies, and that's what we see here on the precision satellite and radar clear skies in northeast Wisconsin. A few lake effect snow showers up near Marquette, Michigan. Notice a few more clouds moving into western Wisconsin. Now, for the most part, these are some thin clouds and uh, we'll still see mostly sunny skies through the day today. And you can see we have the clear skies here in Green Bay. 21 the current temperature in Green Bay. A little bit cooler in Appleton. 18 degrees in Appleton with a wind chill at 7 degrees. So again, bundle up there out there this morning uh, as we look down College Avenue. Notice again on uh, the clear skies overhead. Across northeastern Wisconsin here are the current readings. 15 in Watoma. Now as you get closer to the lake shore here, that's where the temperatures are going to go up a little bit. Waters are still relatively warm. Here 25 in Sturgeon Bay, 24 in Kiwani, 22 uh, the current temperature in Oconto. Now across the Midwest, you'll see again it gets colder to the north here. Colder air continues to move in here from Canada. 10 degrees uh, currently in International Falls, uh, 30s to the south of us, 33 in Peoria, and 36 in Kansas City. As far as our high temperatures here, the next seven days we'll go with 36 for today. That's still above the normal high of 32, uh, but we warm back up to 43 on Thursday, and then our temperatures slide a little bit more. On Friday, 39, 35. On Saturday, 34. Sunday, maybe only 20s for highs uh, next week, Monday and Tuesday. So again, uh, for the most part, the winter-like chill is back in the forecast for today. At least we'll have some sun today. Now tomorrow we'll have more clouds and a small chance of a few showers popping up during the day tomorrow, and another chance for some light snow on Friday. Not too concerned with Friday system. However, late weekend looks like late Sunday and into Monday. Uh, that's when we could have a significant system to be dealing with. Possibly Possibly our first big winter storm here. Still a ways away. Just keep it in mind Sunday night and into Monday. All right, your Midwestern satellite and radar again notice some clouds off to the west, but for the most part, we do have high pressure in place. And this area of high pressure again uh, is going to create quiet conditions through the day today. Clouds will eventually start to thicken up again as we head into tonight. And here comes our chance for showers tomorrow, maybe mixing with a few snowflakes. At least Precision Cast shows that uh, to the north of Green Bay during the day tomorrow. It won't be much. Now, another chance uh, for rainfall and maybe some snow showers on Friday uh, is another system. Uh, dives to the south of us. Your forecast for today will go with a high of 36 degrees, mostly sunny skies. For tonight, low temperature right around 29, becoming mostly cloudy. And here's your seven day, 43 on Thursday. Again, some rain showers Thursday, possibly some snow showers on Friday, 39 degrees on Friday. 35 Saturday, and then this weekend, uh, Sunday. Again, we're watching Sunday evening closely. Of course, Packers game, Sunday night, a lot of people traveling to the Packers game, a lot of people go in there, uh, could be contending with some snow there. Yeah, that could be a sloppy commute mm -hmm. for those living in Milwaukee, too. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And they're going to be coming up, and it could be, again, kind of a messy situation. Yeah. Keep an eye on that.